Hey guys, um, I guess this is going to be my first video, um, just a short backstory. I actually haven't collected cards in probably 15 or more years. Um, I'm 28, uh, my dad and I used to go to card shows and collect cards um, all the time when we were younger. My brother did too, although to a lesser extent. Um, when I was a kid, I'd probably be 12 or 13, um, I had just a ridiculously nice collection of Tigers, Detroit Tigers baseball cards. Um, really, really nice stuff. Um, largely thanks to my father. You know, Al Kaline autos. I had Jim Bunning's rookie card. I had a bunch of stuff ranging from the 1950s, you know, all the way through, I guess, the early 2000s. Um, well, I kind of stopped collecting just because I got other interests, you know, I, I think as many people do. Um, but... It also was the, the sort of the weird scenario that when we moved when I was 17, um, even though I wasn't really collecting then, um, my collection of Tigers cards somehow got lost in the move. I have no idea what happened to it. And that was sort of devastating. Um, I still have all the other cards. Um, I'm kind of a hoarder, so I didn't really sell any of them. Um, they're at my parents' house back in Chicago. But the ones I cared about, the Tigers cards, were gone. Um, but in the weird world of YouTube, I found I kind of like watching people open cards. So I thought I'd try to do it too. Um, I'm only interested in baseball cards, just as a heads up. Um, other than non-mainstream sports, baseball is kind of my focus, and I'm a huge Tigers fan. Um, but I thought I'd open some packs. Um, you know, I don't really know anything about cards anymore, so I'm sure I'll miss stuff. Let me know if I do. I don't know how frequently I'll do this because my budget is sort of put toward other things, but I thought it would be fun. Um, so I bought two things at my local card store today. I'm going to open the Diamond Kings first, and then another video I'll open this um, Topps Heritage Minor League. So, um, hopefully I have enough space left on my camera right now. So this is the 2018 Panini Diamond Kings. You know, I know it's not licensed, but I've really enjoyed watching people open these from the past two years, so I thought I would do it as well. I don't really understand how people do this, so whatever. I really like the sort of art card style of Diamond Kings. Uh, I just find that enjoyable. And like all of us, I'm pretty fascinated by Shohei Otani, um, and I know there's a ton of cards of his in here, so I thought that'd be kind of fun. Anyway, let's get to it. I'm kind of just going to go through the cards. I'm not going to be like super collector here, showing all the short prints and stuff, because I probably won't know it when I find them, um, but I'll let you know what I've got, obviously. Let's see. I've got a uh, Chuck Klein. Brandon Woodruff rookie card, Louis Severino, which is kind of cool. I always like fireballers. Got a red bordered Herb Pennock, Honest Wagner portraits. That's pretty cool. I know it's not a rare card, but I think it's cool looking. Uh, Babe Ruth. Paul Wanner, Wainer, I don't remember how to say his name, and Robinson Cano. Nothing too fascinating in there. Jesus Christ, you can tell it's been a long time since I've opened anything like this. Mike Trout, just the base card. Lefty Gomez. Muscoran, Victor Caratini, Red Border, George Brett, Portraits, Roger Maris, Josh Donaldson, and Victor Robles. Uh, it's a rookie card. I saw an opening of something recently. I can't remember what it was. 
where there was a Victor Robles rookie card in there, and the signature on it was just ridiculous looking. Oh, favorite player, even though he left Detroit, Justin Verlander. Her Pinnock. Tug McGraw. Got a Joe DiMaggio. I guess it's a photo variation. Um, I'm not quite sure what's different about this card, but I know that the um, square border and the backwards cards means that there's something different about it. Past and present, Juan Marichal, Madison Bumgarner. Put that in inserts. Nellie Fox. Andrew McCutcheon. And the normal Victor Caratini. Why are these so hard to open? I think I might just be an idiot. Got George Kelly, Johnny Pesky, Anthony Rizzo from Chicago. So even though I'm a Tigers fan, I like Rizzo. Can't like anyone on the White Sox, obviously. Tommy Heinrich, Reggie Jackson, 500 Club. It's pretty cool. Never did like Reggie Jackson, but oh well. Bobby Thompson, Chris Bryant, and Ted Lyons. Teddy Baseball, Nolan Arenado. Um, was it yesterday he charged the mound after getting beaned? That's pretty funny. Not for him, probably, but... Cody Bellinger, Let's see my Miguel Andujar, um, rookie card, must be some kind of variation since it was backwards. Dallas Keuchel Trophy Club, it's a pretty cool looking card. George Springer, Carl Ferillo, Ferillo, I don't really know how to say his name, and Shoeless Joe. Um, I know I can't like the socks, but I always thought Shoeless Joe was great and sort of. Um, unfairly treated by Major League Baseball, but let's not get into that. Kiki Kyler, Jose Altuve, love Altuve, hell of a player. Ryan McMahon, rookie card. Francisco Lindor, some kind of photo variation. Sepia tones, that's pretty cool. Uh, I hate the Indians as a Tigers fan, but Lindor is pretty badass. Past and present, Roberto Alomar and Jose Ramirez. Grover Alexander. Nick Williams rookie card. And Chris Sale. Gotta hurry up before I run out of the camera. I really need to delete some shit off my phone, apparently. Ernie Banks, Dom DiMaggio, Chris Flexen rookie card, Trey Mancini, and a Jersey King, Ioannis Cespedes. It's not a bad one. Uh, he was a former Tiger, although this doesn't count as a Tiger collection. I always liked his playing. I think he's overpaid, but oh well. And finally, a Shohei Otani rookie card. Um, this one is a pitching card. I guess there's batting and pitching of each of his cards this time. I know that's not an insert, but I'm going to add it to my inserts pile. Anthony Santander rookie card. Harry Walker. Anthony Banda. Rookie card, Tyler Wade rookie, Paul De, De Jong, I guess, Lloyd Wanner, Wainer again, and Albert Pujols, Aurora, those are pretty cool. Filler card, uh, Joey Gallo, Gallery of Stars, Leo DeRocher, Heine Gro, an unfortunate name, Lou Gehrig, and Mookie Betts. Oh. 
Mickey Mantle. Pee Wee Reese, who I once dressed up as for a school presentation. Aaron Judge. David Ortiz. One out of 49, Brown Border. It's pretty cool, although I was never a huge David Ortiz fan, personally. King Griffey Jr., 500 Club. That's a cool card. I always liked Griffey. Stem Usual. Paul Goldschmidt. Wish he played for someone cooler than Arizona. And Roberto Clemente. Making a mess over here. Pocket, Harry Hooper, Don Larson, Corey Kluber, Justin Turner, Gallery of Stars, Clayton Kershaw, Max Carey, and Jim Thorpe. I feel like I haven't gotten a single Tiger yet, which is sort of weird. I know they're bad this year, but they're probably going to be bad this year. Shohei Otani rookie card. Batting that time. Tony Lazari. Tyler Malley, is that how you say his name? Andrew Stevenson. Some kind of variation rookie card, I guess. Filler card. Means the uh, auto or other relic in the last one, I guess. Verlander Trophy Club. Gabby Hartnett. Nikki Delmonico. And Jim Bottomley. Last pack. Buster Posey. Carla Erskine. Dylan Peters rookie card. Joe Cronin. Um, I did not do that right, but it's okay. Carlos Correa. Billy Herman, Bryce Harper, I still did that wrong, that's really embarrassing. Ah, oh, it's amazing, Wade Boggs, that's so cool. Wade Boggs sticker autograph, that's a pretty sweet card for a, a first box of cards in 15 years. Cool. Well, that's my box of Diamond Kings. My hits were the Wade Boggs signature, that's pretty awesome. And the Jersey Kings from Ioannis Cespedes. Um, this is a pretty good budget-oriented hobby box, I think, because you do get a really thick stack of inserts and photo variations. Um, you know, they're not really worth much, but they're still cool looking. Um, it's a good way to build a collection, I think. Although maybe not if you're a Tigers fan. Um, but anyway, thank you so much for watching my first unboxing of cards in 15 years. Uh, see you soon.